Hey, what's up guys? Spartan Gaming here, and we are back today on Ark Survival Evolved, of course on the Xbox One. And today I'm going to show you guys how to get oil and silica pearls. Uh, this works on PC as well, so if you want to do it there, that works. Um, so first things first, you're going to need a mount, um, either a plesiosaur or an ichthyosaur, preferably. Um, I would say an ichthyosaur, just because you're easier to tame, and it's just a lot easier to get them, and the saddles are cheaper, you can get them earlier on. So I got myself a saddle in my inventory and some ichthyosaurs by the water. Next, um, you're not going to need this, but it's definitely nice to have. It's the Lazarus recipe. First, you're going to need a cooking pot, and then you're going to need five sav root, which is pretty much potatoes, uh, five long grass, which is the corn, handful of medjah berries, some cooked meat, specifically cooked meat, not raw meat, uh, three of that, Narcotics, not narco berries, narcotics. And then again, like I said, a handful of medjah berries, so just throw some medjah berries in there. Um, so that'll give you a boost to um, your oxygen. Now, you could get away with this with 200 oxygen, bare minimum, but you'd want to have at least 200 to 300, 300 feeling comfortable without having the Lazarus. So we're going to fly on down here, and we're going to go and see these ichthyosaurs real quick. Now the only thing difficult to get about the ichthyosaur saddle is for early game people it's 10 metal, not ingots, just regular metal. Um, so I'm just gonna go ahead and throw this on one of these guys. There we go, and we're gonna be taking Orca right here. Close the gate because it was left open. And next step is just to go offshore. And there's a cool little trick about this that uh, that works in the Xbox One. I'm not sure if it works in PC or anything like that. Obviously, I'm not on it, but it's a pretty neat trick. And I'll show you once we get out there. Um, typically, you could get the scuba gear. It'd be nicer to have that, but. I'm not that far in the game yet, so none of that quite yet. So what I do, is we're going to check it once we get past these rocks, is you can hop off your mount, and if you hold A, which is uh, to swim up and look down, you can actually see whatever you want through the world. So as you can see it right there, you can see anything and everything. So I can see there's another ichthyosaur right there, and all those little shining things, those are the silica pearls that we want. So the silica pearls are easier to get, in my opinion, than the oil, just because of how easy they are to see them. So what I would do is swim over here and try and line it up to where I can swim just straight down. All right. You can see the oil as well. You see that little black dot over there? That's oil. When we get closer, you'll be able to tell what it is. Let's swim all the way down here. Keep an eye out for Megalodon, because they will... I'll mess up your day, to say the least. And I find it funny, you know, whistle underwater. So you just gotta take your hands out and gather yourself some silica pearls and not get on your mount while you're at it. Alright, so I'm over here, grab these ones. And use the right thumbstick, click it down to go down in the water and hold A to go up. Alright, so let's get on Orca. And we're going to swim straight up, get our oxygen. This is the, exactly the reason why you'd rather have an ichthyosaur or a plesiosaur, because the megalodons are a lot slower. I mean, you could level one up, but... Eh. Alright, so I'm going to go up real quick, and we're going to look for some oil. So looking around, there's oil that away. So where's Orca? You wanna... That's your shit, Orca? There we go. So let's swim down. Now for oil, they're a bit easier to see. Uh, just because they have this long trail of, well, oil. So you're gonna go ahead and pull out your pickaxe and you're gonna mine it without killing your mount because it's happened and it sucks.
Now you could go and find underwater caves and you can get oil and silica pearls. Um, I've seen people get more silica pearls from caves, but uh, I don't really go cave diving because that's a bit of a like a, a just a bit of a risk because you know you get lost easy and it's just you're trying to get your stuff real quick and get the hell out of there. So <clears throat> that's gonna be that. It's real simple, real easy. You just go offshore, need a mount. Um, if you want to know how to tame these ichthyosaurs, pretty much all you need to do is find one, and it'll swim up to you, and these fuckers will follow you around everywhere. And you need to take raw meat, put it in your last item slot, so right here where the long neck rifle is, the item right there, raw meat, and it'll press Y to hand feed it meat. And it'll bring the taming bar up, and then it'll keep following you around until it's ready to eat again, and then you get yourself an ichthyosaur. Go ahead and make the saddle and you are set to go. So I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Hope you found it helpful. If you did, remember to smash that like button. Uh, if you have any questions, go ahead and leave a comment and I'll get back to you as soon as possible. And besides that, remember to subscribe to my channel for more content. So thank you for watching and I'll see you guys next time.